either just play this down to the beat like this, or we sit on the beat with a certain buoyancy upward. But you're sitting to come up. It's kind of hard to explain. But everybody has this figure at one point or another in the two. Bam, bam, ba -dum. Right? Even if the lyric is clear. Love calling. Okay? So, you guys don't get ahead of it. Like, dum, bum, like, don't crush me. Love's calling. Okay? Think of who we're playing about and think of the lyrics of the tune. Everybody has it at one point or another. Everybody does. Now, the question back there. Same type of thing. You guys are like our motor. You the little dude, you like the engine that won't let us rest. While we sitting back here grooving like this, you guys are like, check in us along, keep us going right along. Don't let us fall behind, even though we're sitting back, keep <coughs> going, make it bad. You know, all that's, that's you guys. So this shaker business, you need to find the right color that cuts through what's happening, that doesn't interfere with the other stuff that you gotta play. You got a tambourine? Hear the sound of your tambourine and find a shaker that does not sound just like it. So that I get not I get the same sound. No, you got an arsenal of stuff up there. So you just you're supposed to pick and choose. Find get the concept of what we're doing and find the right instruments for what we're gonna do. If you guys are limited to what you have, you need to talk to somebody. Because you're accompanying a vocalist and they they're so picky. And I don't mean picky in a negative way. It's that their voice is a constant. It's going to sit right here, and all the other color around it has to be around it. And if you're in a frequency that's right on top of it, it's annoying. So, orchestrate yourselves up there. You got some help now. Orchestrate yourselves so that you know what you're doing. Find what you need. If that shape is too heavy and it's not cute, it's a nice little bounce through the It's the wrong one. It's wrong. Put it away. Find the next one. And you guys are supposed to do that before them. So you should know, you have like two or three out. The first one you pick it, you okay, that didn't work. When I come in again, I'll play this one. That's not the one. <coughs> Coming again, I'll play this one. That's the one. Now I got it. I'm going to use this one for this turn. Okay. Ultimately, you're supposed to know the sounds of everything up there so that you would always grab the record. See, at least it's written for you. Sometimes you've got no parts, and you've got to just go for, it, go for it yourself. That means you have to know what everything you have on your table sounds like so well. But... So pick and choose for me. Do a little homework on a break and also between now and Thursday to have what you want. Okay. It'll make it'll make you play it'll make your playing sound so much different. So much different. Because you play good. Okay. Same thing from last time. Don't now we I know it's short and I know long. Now just play short and long. Don't make don't make a big federal case out of short and long. Short play it a little short. It's long play it. And it'll groove a little better. You know what it is already. Now you can play the music. Okay? All right. That's my speech. Same thing with you guys. Love calling. You could have called me. I'm not coming the way that you're saying it. I, I don't, I'm here. And I don't mean hear you like God. I mean like just feel you. Love calling. You heard the thing. So, okay. I'm going to 